Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight. Welcome to Pamela, an open world survival horror game that is currently in early access that is set in a dystopian kind of cyberpunky world, a, a cyberpunk city of the future to be precise. But let's not waste any time with me rambling on about it. Let's jump in and see for ourselves what it's like. All right, then. Let's see. Permadeath. Uh, that sounds cool, but we'll turn that off for now. Only melee weapons can be found or crafted. Wounded effect. You move more slowly when you're... Sure, well, let's turn that on. That sounds cool. Always wanted. Speakers are all, or seekers are always aggressive and attack on sight. Okay, cool. Ah, so we can actually get more points, but the game becomes more difficult. All right. That's pretty cool. We'll uh, I'll only turn this one on for now, and then we'll kind of see where the game goes from there. Since I figure for just a quick uh, preview of like one or two episodes to start us off with, you know, it makes sense not to not to make things too difficult, so we can get a, a fuller experience. Alrighty then, let's get on into the game. That was quite a loading screen. I think it loaded the whole game right there. Ah yes, nothing like waking up in the morning in a giant tank of water. Definitely wouldn't set off my hydrophobia. I can hear you. You're there, aren't you? I was so afraid that this fragment would decay before you awoke. I'm sorry, but I haven't much time. I implore you, seek out my prime cognizance. Okay, lady, okay. I can the do that. The mainframe has gone completely dark. She's all alone. Gee, you say. Well, that's oh, definitely scary. Be careful. The citizens are, well, you'll see. Please, before it's too late. Okay, dokely. I'll do what I can, creepy, ghosty lady person. This. Alright, aha! Alright, so we've got some sweet items here. A circuit and a medi-hypo. Sure, we'll pick up everything because that's how gaming by gaslight rolls. Let's see. Eat and drink to maintain vitals. Open the inventory with I. Right-click to open action menu to use. All right, we'll uh, go ahead and drink ourselves a little bit of scotch here, because why not? I do enjoy a little bit of scotch after waking up from hyper cryo mega sleep. All right. Oop. All right, crouch and no jump. Okay, space is to go backwards. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Alrighty then. Okay, so right, right hands up, left hand, or let go of it, uh, hands down. Gotcha, 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 again. Alright, just uh, walking along. Oop. Oop. Arm, open the arm menu of tab, select menu options with the middle mouse button, left click to go forward, right click to go backwards. Alright, Pamela, what do we got here? Billy Doakley, we got our like sweet little uh, powery things here, but we don't actually have anything to. Let's see, Pamela accumulates genetic energy. R to equip and unequip the IPG, scan nearby containers and items. All right. Uh, let's, uh, yeah, we'll. Doakley Doakley, so we can scan, switch modes. All righty then. See here, scan area, pair or harvest with the left button, and again, switch modes. All right, so we can see that there is something cool that we can interact with right here, which there is actually nothing inside of it, unfortunately. But there is some money, and money is pretty sweet. I do enjoy money. All right. You can go away for now, sir. Can I just, like, punch you open? Never that simple, is it? Oh, what do we got here? 
Uh, you can view all tutorial content in the datapad hacking logic. Locked containers and doors that are not locked by key codes can be hacked to gain access. In the logic hacking minigame, use the mouse wheel to choose ciphers, matching the glyph below, then press the button to decrypt. If you fail twice or time ran out, an alarm will be triggered to alert seeker units to your presence. Okay, pretty straightforward. I will right, we'll skip those tutorials. Okay, so we need to match. Uh oh. Mouse wheel's not doing anything, man. Let's just uh, cancel out of that for now. We'll come back to that in a second there. Why do I feel like I'm hitting an invisible wall so I can't go over here? Garbage literally blocking my path. Damn you invisible garbage wall. Oh, but I can walk over over that much easier. Ooh, what's this? Tentacles. I love tentacles. Nothing bad has ever happened involving tentacles, that's for sure. Actually, you know what? I need to uh, go into the options and see here. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Head bob, tilt. I feel a little bit like my uh, head is, or moving back and forth, looking around with the mouse is not quite as... Uh, uh, move it up to about two. See if that about does it for me. There we go. About the same. Boop and boop. And other boop to get back into place here. What do we got here? Cryo Bay requires a cryo core. Oh yeah, this this is much better. Alright. Onwards and outwards then. Oh. I can Oh now I can cross. You were just teasing me, game. That's what you were doing. I hate a tease. Okay, hacking, reflex. Lock containers and doors that are not locked by key codes can be hacked to gain access. In the reflex mini hacking minigame, press E or left button while the spinner is on top of the indicated segments. Oh hell. Well, I can totally do this. Nope, never mind. Oh, I'm a god. Shite. Never mind, I'm not a god. Oh hell. You know what? Let's uh just uh, back out of that. <laughs> uh no, we were not our Ooh, what's this? Basically gonna spend this entire episode with me just like wandering around not actually accomplishing anything. Because that's how gaming by gaslight rules, obviously. Got over here anything cool? I mean I guess I could just uh no. I could just scan. If we really wanted to. Get an idea of where all the cool stuff is. Alright. More locked stuff. Why does everything have to be locked? Okay, it's only medium. Booyah! Booyah! Not quite booyah. Oh yeah, maximum unlocky levelness. What is this? An upgrade set. Ooh, simple multi-purpose piece of technology that unlocks the latent potential in various attachments. Okay. All right, I like that. I like that a lot. Ooh, what's this? Why do I? Why is my first instinct to always punch things? I don't know. Yeah. Grab the items. Upgrade cell acquired. Upgrading attachments. Using upgrade nodes found within Eden, attachments can be upgraded to enhance their capabilities and unlock special abilities. In the inventory menu, select an attachment, then select the upgrade tab. Click on the nodes to spend upgrade cells and unlock upgrades. Okay, let's uh let's do that right off the bat. So we're over here. Turn to upgrades. Schematic not available, so I guess we have to go find that first of all. What do we got over here? We got some optional character HUD. Provide passive benefits. We got a light. Like all stuff that we can fit in there. Ooh, color override. Yeah, cool colors apparently. I like the sound of all that. Alright, but let's uh you know, I mean how how long have we been playing? 13 minutes, give or take, and most of it has been spent with me just kind of like very slowly wandering around. Ooh, food. I like grapes. And plastic. I like that. 
Oh, pretty good. More cryo cells that we don't really care that much about for the time being, anyway. Oh, hello, uh, dead body. I didn't see you down there. You know, because I normally... Oh, dear. I'm just going to kick you repeatedly, dead body. Just to make sure you're actually dead and not... Oh, hello. Alright, uh, let's pull out the old scanamajig. Okay, you seem to be in, in very much point of fact dead. You have like bone growing out of your eyeball, maybe? Or crazy mechanical part? I mean, you kind of look like you're made out of plastic. Are you, are you even a real person? Are you just plastic? Maybe. All I know for sure is that I don't know anything at all. What do we got here? Let's see. Emergency broadcast, garrison official alert, possible widespread contamination. Many reports have been received in the recent days that are indicating a possible affliction of unknown origin and effect. We are advising residents to remain within their homes whenever possible and to maintain distance with all unnecessary individuals. Arc Medical and Biostera are currently investigating the scope of the contamination and have asked anyone with these symptoms to immediately report to an arc clinic. If you have chronic migraines, fatigue, Stiffness or soreness of joints and abnormal growths. Well, that kind of actually matches me in real life. Maybe I should show up at this place. I just ask that you please remain calm. Any and all illnesses will be quickly resolved once we discover the root cause of this incident. Also, I just noticed that I have, like, food and hunger-related needs. That's... Well, okay, we got a thingy over there. I don't Shortly know why... after I awoke, I asked the technicians why I couldn't feel my hands. Their blank faces offered no answers. Okay. Shortly after I awoke, I asked the technicians why I couldn't feel my hands. Their blank faces offered no answers. Yeah. Ooh, today's daily deals. What do we got here? I can't afford any of this, except for this pill. But do I want a pill? Probably not. I mean, pills are for losers. Maybe. Alright, we'll scan this thingamajig. Got no items in it, so it does not concern me in the least. There's nothing else for me to really explore around here, is there? I like to get very thorough. Oh yeah, there's like stuff all the way over here also. You may hear Ace in the background over there kind of barking at something. Or other, as he sometimes does. Oddly enough, he seems to get a little bit more, uh, a little bit more, okay, it's locked. A little bit more restless later in the day as opposed to what you might think. What is this? Some ooh morphine. Morphine's fun. Circuits, uh, thermal paste, all good items. We'll just take everything. As long as we have the inventory space we will just keep grabbing things. Because that's what you do it. Grab everything you can. You never know when it's gonna be handy. We'll unlock the other stuff later. There's like a dead guy. We have some person who's like frozen in place. That's actually concerning. Uh, also concerning is the fact that, uh, hello there, friendo. Yeah, it's so very quiet. So, so very, very quiet. Yay. Ooh, there's a trash can. Trash cans are fun. We can, we can dump stuff in there if we absolutely need to, I guess. What do you got to say? A new wing was added to Ark Medical. The permits state it is to further research the decaying genetic material found in residents. Well, that's definitely not disturbing at all. Decaying you don't suppose these fellas are going to come to life at night or something, are you? Yeah, could happen. You look very mechanical, very synthetic. I'll take that money. I mean, I don't really know what- Do you need directions? Oh, hello. Yes. Yes, I do. Hi. Hello there. I'm just gonna, like, steal your money right in front of you. Okay. So, there's someone alive. Them? Yeah, yeah click. Clickety. Click. Clickety. Can I... Oh. <laughs> I'm doing it again where I'm, like, cl left clicking. Oh. What? That's kind of awkward. <laughs> Attachments equipping. There are three types of arm attachments. Weapon, utility, and power source. Up to five can be equipped at a time. Two weapon, two utility, ut uh, utility, and one power. 
After you pick up an attachment, open your inventory, drag the attachment into the appropriate slot to equip. Okay. Aiming and shooting. Once equipped, weapon attachments can be aimed and fired. That is a sick crossbow right there. All right, right to aim, left to fire, mouse scroll to alternate fire. Switching weapons and reloading. Press T to switch between equipped four and dorsal weapons. Press R while aiming to reload. Uh, there are two utility attachments, active and passive. Active utilities must be used manually to trigger their ability, while passives always bestow their bonus. Press free to activate utility attachment. Alrighty then, that's uh, pretty cool. Let's go pop open the old inventory majig and get a look at... Kind of back away from the screen there, because all the menus are like actual physical game object-y things that, uh, yeah. Alright, so what was that upgrade we got? Commerce module, symbolic mechanized charm that aims to increase the user's bargaining ability with shops. Alright, so I assume that goes into utility slot number two? Oh, wait, that's where I would assume it goes. Wait. What are we doing here? Dorsal. Am I wrong with this? No, it's a utility. Goes in here. Started to make a noise that indicated you might be doing something I wanted you to do. Oh, there we go. Right click. Oops. Uh, crap. <laughs> Did I get this wrong? Oh, wait. Derp. <laughs> Put it in the entirely wrong spot. It goes over here in my gadget slot. Not over here. Man. Alright. Well, I feel extra dumb there. Nothing of use inside there. Alright, we can just uh, wander on into the back room, I'm sure. No one's fine. Alright. Massive Reservoir expands the onboard energy capacity of the arm immensely while at the same time reducing energy costs. Well, that sounds actually pretty useful. Let's uh, pop open the old inventory. What is this? Uh, I mean, it says it's a utility. So, oh, it's a power. Okay. Oh, oh, I see. This is where the upgrades come from now. So we can, like, upgrade the capacity of this. Or, uh... No, no, I don't want you to... They want to actually pick you up. Description. Power Reservoir. Oh, I guess... Okay, so these can be upgraded. These, not so much. Alright, I'm learning. I, I can piece these things together. Ah. Let's eat this apple. Because I kind of feel like eating an apple. An apple day keeps the doctor away as I slowly figure... Ooh, a key code. Press E on the door's keypad to enter. Oakley to play. So when we find that... Wow, this is a really... Really poorly secured thingamajig. Wow, that was easy. Ooh, what's this? An adrenaline hypo, and that is all. Oh, I didn't actually pick it up. And then I tried punching it again. I don't know why I feel the need to hit, like, left click in order to... Ooh, what's this? Another, uh, another bit of money? Hey there, robo lady. If I interact with you in some way. There. Hi. Can I if punch you? If you need anything, please let me know. I will, thank you. I won't punch you, though. You may be just a machine, but... You know, you're not, uh... You know, you deserve a little bit of dignity, at least. Right, some more food. Food is good. Never know when we're gonna need food around here in this cold, heartless world that we live in. Right, what have in here? Not a dang thing, that's unfortunate. Right, just the regular old bathrooms that you'd expect. Really? There's that's supposed to be like what, an ash disposal thingy? Or a trash can. Another trash can. There's a lot of trash cans. The people in the city need like trash cans every five seconds because otherwise they'll just throw it on the ground and you can't have that in paradise can you let me check you out yet we have and there is nothing no you know 
gotta tell you, it's kind of, uh, kind of disturbing me seeing all these people like that. Also, that, um, I'm gonna backtrack for just a sec. I'll be right back. Yeah, I wanted to check to see if, uh, this open. Oop, boop. Keep wanting to punch things. It's a bad look for me, honestly. Alright, so then we can boop that open. And then we can open this. Which contains plastic and also a uh, super hydro. Vegan health gets reduced. Excellent. Aha! A thingamajig. More thingamajigs. Security bypasses. Oh. That's probably a way to make hacking easier if I were to guess. It... Oh. Oh, it's actually that easy to open this door. Hi there, friendo. Anything uh, of interest in here? Hi. Can I punch you? What happens if I punch you? You do not react even a little bit. And then I'll punch that because I like punching things. Alright, so... Ah, I see. We're trying to, like, blend things together. Okay. Oh, I got you. I got you. Okay. I can, I can figure this one out. Probably. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I feel like I'm not making... Oh, God. I don't have much time. I don't feel like I'm making any progress with this. Okay, so we got like the box. Then we need like the little loopity thing. I guess that's that. And oh god. Oh lord. Oh, there's just too much. <laughs> too much to figure. Oh god. Well. I got locked out of that one. I feel kind of dumb. All right, let's move on. All right, back to the exit. Let's move on and make a little bit of progress if we can. All right, never trash can. Nothing's in it, apparently. Cool. Getting a little ominous over here. What are, what are you? Oh, you have an orange. Oranges are nice. I like oranges. I kind of feel bad for you. I am thirsty. That is useful to know. Do I have, like, uh, grape soda or something? Or a canned lemon. That'll... That'll do enough. Did that help my thirst in any way? Uh... A... B... User energy is low, apparently. And, uh. Yo, dog! Why? Well. Oh, my. Uh. Okay. I guess, uh, well, he wasn't, he wasn't, you know, violent. That's probably a good thing. Thermal paste, because thermal paste is nice. Gets you stuff. Keeps stuff from getting too hot. Don't want your, uh, CPU blowing. Ooh, there we go. Go straight up drink that whiskey right there. Oh, we don't, there's not even anything on TV. That sucks. How am I supposed to be entertained in this day and age? Um, no, it occurs to me. If I can't jump, how do I... How did I get over here the last time? That's a nice, uh, a nice view, though. Oh, yeah. I'll figure out how to get... I jumped for a second there. There we go. Third time's the charm. Do we need to use the bathroom? No. We don't even have a reflection. That's kind of ominous. Rehabilitation ward, you say? 
Now, if I just kept running away, would we Emma have- Emma is smiling today. She says that the project is on track to finish within nine months. She thinks I can't see the momentary sadness in her eyes. Ookily dookily. Sadness, you say? Well, you know what they say about sadness? It- oh, oh, found in lobby. Found in lobby. Uh, only deaf. We are all infected. No stop. Well. Oh, and you're dead. That's... That's rather unfortunate. I mean, that's a good way to start the day, is finding out that everyone you know and love is dead. That certainly makes me feel better in the morning. We'll explore more later, but for now, I want to keep exploring, especially because this uh, episode's been going for a bit. Alright, so the key... The key thing is, don't engage the robots, because they will drag you off to Dreamland, and I don't want to go to Dreamland right now. Because we have important things to do, worlds to save, there is- ooh. Probably a bad idea. Open up those quarantine sh- oh shite. Um, hello. I heard something down there. Hey there. Hundo. There is no need to hurry. Okay, well, you're you look like a friendly uh fembot, so I'll just uh you know, leave you be. I could punch you. I mean, we could dismantle you for parts, but you haven't hurt me like that other that other robot did, the mandroid. Stupid mandroids. That's cool. Oh, what's this? Combat attacking left button. Oh, why is it telling me this? Oh, hello. No, I don't want to die, dog. Ow, you dick. Oh boy. Can I, uh, block? Maybe. Okay. Hold up there, friendo. No, huh? You wanna go? You wanna go? Ow! Stop it, you dick! And... And I died. Wow, I really suck. I can't even fight. That's, uh... Really. Anyway, let, let's wrap let's wrap things up here. We'll probably maybe fight better next time. But for now, that's it for this video. So until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking. Always extra special important for anything new on the channel. And I will see all you in the next video.